Lisbon, the enchanting capital of Portugal, is a city rich in history, culture, and natural beauty. Often overshadowed by other European capitals, Lisbon is an undiscovered gem that offers unique and authentic travel experience. In this insider's guide, we will explore 10 must-see attractions and hidden gems in and around Lisbon, providing you with everything you need to know to make the most of your visit, including costs, operating hours, and fascinating trivia. Number 1. Bellum Tower Cost €6 Euros for adults, €3 Euros for children under 12, and seniors 65+. plus. Hours 10 to 5 p.m. October to March, 10 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. April to September. Trivia Bellum Tower was originally built as a fortress to defend the city from maritime attacks. Bellum Tower, also known as the Tower of St. Vincent, is a fortified tower located in the district of Bellum in Lisbon, Portugal. It was built between 1514 and 1520 as a part of a larger defense system to protect the city from attacks. The tower was designed by Francisco de Arruda, a Portuguese architect, and showcases the Manuline architectural style, which is characterized by ornate, intricate carvings of maritime motifs such as ropes, shells, and sea monsters. The tower is constructed of limestone and consists of four levels, including a bastion and a terrace. The tower's architecture is a mix of Gothic, Moorish, and Renaissance styles, reflecting Portugal's maritime history and cultural influences. The tower's exterior features intricate carvings and sculptures, including the coat of arms of Portugal, the cross of the Order of Christ, and an image of St. Vincent, the patron saint of Lisbon. In 1983, Bellum Tower was designed as a UNESCO World Heritage Site in recognition of its cultural significance and unique architectural style. Number 2. Geronimos Monastery Cost 10 euros for adults, 5 euros for children under 12 and seniors 65 plus. Hours 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. October to March, 10 a.m. to 6.30 p.m. April to September. Trivia The monastery is home to the tomb of the famous explorer Vasco da Gama. The Geronimos Monastery, also known as the Hieronymites Monastery, is a magnificent monument located in the Bellum district of Lisbon, Portugal. The monastery was built between 1501 and 1601 during the reign of King Manuel I and is considered one of the finest examples of Manuline architecture in the world. The monastery was designed by Portuguese architect Diogo de Botica and features intricate carvings, arches, and vaulted ceilings, inspired by Portugal's maritime history and seafaring traditions. The monastery's most notable feature is its stunning cloister, which is considered one of the most beautiful in the world. The cloister features elaborately carved columns and arches with intricate detailing of maritime motifs, such as ropes, anchors, and sea monsters. The cloister also houses the tomb of Vasco da Gama, the famous Portuguese explorer who discovered the sea route to India. Number 3. Alfama District. Cost free. Hours 24-7. Trivia. Alfama is the oldest district in Lisbon and was once inhabited by the city's poorest residents. The Alfama district is one of the oldest and most picturesque neighborhoods of Lisbon, Portugal. Its narrow, winding streets and alleys are a labyrinth of cobblestone paths that lead visitors through a maze of charming houses, local shops, and hidden squares. The district is perched on a hill overlooking the Tagus River, offering breathtaking views of the city and its surroundings. One of the highlights of the Alfama district is the Fado Museum, which is dedicated to Portugal's melancholic and soulful national music. Fado is a traditional form of music that originated in Lisbon in the 19th century and is characterized by its mournful and introspective lyrics. Number 4. LX Factory Cost free. Hours varies by establishment. Trivia. LX Factory occupies a former industrial complex that dates back to 1846. 
LX Factory is a creative and cultural hub located in the Alcantara neighborhood of Lisbon, Portugal. This former industrial complex has been transformed into a vibrant and eclectic space that showcases the city's contemporary art, culture, and entertainment scene. The complex is spread over several buildings and courtyards, offering visitors a unique and immersive experience. The complex is home to numerous galleries, studios, and exhibition spaces, where visitors can discover the works of emerging and established artists from Portugal and beyond. The galleries feature a wide range of art, including painting, sculpture, photography, and mixed media, and often host temporary exhibitions and events. Number 5. Sintra. Cost and hours varies by attraction. Trivia. Sintra is home to the colorful Penna Palace, a 19th century romanticist castle that sits atop a hill. Sintra is a picturesque town located just a short train ride from Lisbon, Portugal, nestled in a lush green hills of the Sintra Mountains. This UNESCO World Heritage Site is known for its stunning palaces, castles and gardens, as well as its enchanting atmosphere and magical charm. One of the most famous attractions in Sintra is the Quinta da Rigalaira, a magnificent palace and garden complex that is a testament to the romantic and mystical spirit of the town. The palace was built in the early 20th century by Carvalho Monteiro, a wealthy Portuguese businessman and features a mix of Gothic, Renaissance, and Mezzulene architectural styles. The palace is surrounded by beautiful gardens, grottoes, and fountains, and is adorned with intricate carvings, sculptures, and symbols that reflect Monteiro's fascination with alchemy and the occult. Another must-visit attraction in Sintra is the Montserrat Palace, an enchanting palace that is considered one of the finest examples of romantic architecture in Portugal. Number 6. LX Love Tiles. Cost free. Hours 24-7. Trivia. The LX Love Tiles project began in 2013 as a way to preserve and celebrate the city's tile heritage. LX Love Tiles is a project that celebrates the traditional Portuguese azulejo, or tiles, which are an important part of Lisbon's cultural heritage. These colorful, decorative tiles can be found throughout the city, adorning buildings, churches, and public spaces with intricate patterns and designs. The LX Love Tiles project was launched in 2016 and features a series of colorful murals that pay homage to Lisbon's Azulejo tradition. These murals are scattered throughout the city, adding a splash of color and vibrancy to the urban landscape. The murals feature a range of designs from abstract patterns and geometric shapes to figurative images and traditional motifs. The project is a collaboration between the Lisbon City Council and Love Tiles, a Portuguese tile manufacturer with a long history of producing high-quality azulejos. Number 7. Cuscais. Cost free. Hours 24-7. Trivia. Cuscais was once a small fishing village and rose to prominence as a popular resort destination for European royalty. This picturesque coastal town, just 40-minute train ride from Lisbon, offers a perfect escape from the city. Stroll along the scenic promenade, relax on sandy beaches, or explore the charming historic center filled with shops, restaurants, and museums. Number 8. Avenida da Liberdade. Cost free. Hours 24-7. Trivia. Avenida da Liberdade was inspired by Paris's famous Champs Elysees. Avenida da Liberdade is Lisbon's most prestigious boulevard and a must visit destination for anyone traveling to the city. This tree lined avenue stretches for over a kilometer and is lined with luxurious boutiques, high end hotels, and fine dining restaurants. The avenue was designed in the 19th century by French architect Baron Haussmann who also designed the famous Champs-Élysées in Paris. The avenue's wide sidewalks, landscaped gardens, and elegant buildings make it one of the most beautiful and iconic streets in Lisbon.
One of the highlights of Avenida da Liberdade is its beautiful architecture, which ranges from Art Nouveau to Art Deco to modernist styles. Number nine, Time Out Market. Cost, free entrance, food prices vary. Hours, 10 a.m. to midnight, Sunday to Wednesday. 10 a.m. to 2 a.m. Thursday to Saturday. Trivia. The market has been operating since 1892 and was transformed into a gastronomic hub in 2014. Time Out Market is a trendy and popular food hall located in the Cais do Sudre neighborhood of Lisbon, Portugal. The market is housed in a historic building that was once a fruit and vegetable market and has been transformed into a vibrant and bustling culinary destination. The market features over 20 food stalls, each offering a unique and delicious culinary experience. The stalls are curated by Time Out magazine, which selects some of Lisbon's top chefs and restaurants to participate in the market. Visitors can sample a wide variety of cuisine from traditional Portuguese dishes to international flavors. Number 10, Gulbenkian Museum. Cost, 14 euros for adults, free for children under 18 and seniors 65 plus. Hours 10 a.m. to 6 p.m., closed on Tuesdays. The museum is named after Kalaus Gulbenkian, an Armenian oil magnate who collected a vast array of art and artifacts throughout his lifetime. The Golden Kian Museum houses an impressive collection of art and artifacts from around the world, spanning over 5,000 years of history. From ancient Egyptian treasures to masterpieces by European artists, such as Rembrandt and Turner, the museum offers a fascinating insight into the beauty and diversity of human creativity.